everyone, it's Mayumi. How are you doing? I really hope you are having a great day wherever you are. And today I'm going to do my April favorites video. And I really hope you enjoy watching. But before I begin, I thought I would update my life a little bit um, so that you get to know me a little bit more, I think. So, yeah, April. It was a really exciting and busy and stressful month, I would say. Um, I moved to my new place and I started working full time and everything was new and I was just really stressed out and I was really busy getting to getting used to my new life and getting used to my new environment and new lifestyle. So it was a really stressful months but um, I really enjoyed getting to know some new people and um, yeah but most of the time I was really tired and um, I really didn't have time to just really really relax or um, just chill out it was most of the time I was really tired and just like I don't know stressed out about my life I always I tend to go like super super depressed and negative um, so I try not to do that so yeah I really am trying to stay positive and just go for it but um, how is your life I want to know how you're doing um, if you're my friends I would love to know if you're not my friends I still want to know so you can text me you can um, just tweet me or you can comment down below and tell me how you're doing because I'd love to know and I'd love to talk to you so do that anyway I'm going to start my April favorites and I really hope you enjoy watching so I'm going to start my April favorites with um, a skincare product and this is the Kiehl's Midnight Treatment actually Midnight Recovery Concentrate and this is amazing so like I was saying um, I was really stressed out and my life was really busy in April so um, my skin was really not in a good condition um, so um, I really enjoyed using this I've been using this for over a year now and this is just amazing it's a oil or serum I would say it, it says oil it smells really relaxing first of all it's amazing it smells good okay, I'm gonna read what it says in here because it's probably better than my explanation um, it says a replenish replenishing ex elixir 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 of pure essential oils and distilled botanicals to visibly restore the appearance of skin by morning yes it does exactly what it says I apply this oil before I go to bed and it magically changes your skin till the morning um, when you wake up in the morning you will notice that your skin is smoother and moisturized and toned really nicely it's just so good and I I recommend this to everyone even even for guys I think this is really good I don't know like much about guys skincare or anything but I've seen some guys who have like really horrible skin um, no offense but like guys also need to um, take care of their skin I th I think usually skincare products is like it doesn't work overnight you know like um, whitening products or pimple treatment, spot treatment, it, usually you have to be patient and you have to use it at least for two weeks to see the result but uh, when it comes to this product um, it really works overnight so if you want like fast recovery or um, if you want to um, treat your skin overnight um, I highly recommend this and it's quite expensive 
but I kind of I almost kind of guarantee that it's gonna work because it's so good and um, yeah you should really really try it um, if you are skeptical about getting this product you can go to Kiehl's counter and before you buy it you can um, try the samples and if you like it um, you can buy this because it's really really good and I highly recommend and it saved my life this month and I just think it's an amazing product so I love Kiehl's I love Kiehl's products in general but this is like my ah products so yeah next is a makeup item and this is by Bare Minerals and it's their Frame and Define brow pen and it's a brow pencil you twist it and the little thing will show up and this I I never used eyebrow pencil because I don't like the way it looks but um I always use a brow powder, Anastasia powder that I really like, but um, I thought I would give it a go because I don't know, I felt like it. <laughs> Recently I started to use this and I just kind of frame my brows first with this pen and then apply powder, um, brow powder. It's easier to shape my brows and also I use less brow powder so it's really good for the environment I guess. <laughs> but it's really good and um, yeah I have the shades Universal Dark. I'm pretty sure it's like the darkest color or darker ones that they have. But it's amazing. It's really soft. I really hate the products when I have to like scrub it and it's still not coming off. But this is really easy to write and easy to um, shape my brows. And it also has this um, brush that you can comb it, comb your brows. So it's really good. Next, I have a hair care product. And I got this one in Japan. This is a Japanese brand. Um, it's called Mon Charut. Mon Charut. Apolina Organic Hair Milk. It looks like this. If you live in Japan, you should try this. I have a really fine hair, so when it gets humid or when it gets dried, my hair just go like... You know, it's horrible. It's just like... I can't do anything about it. So I was looking for some products that makes my hair a little bit more settle down and just moisturize my hair and I really want it to make it easier to style my hair. And I really like how it smells. It smells really good. And um, yeah, I like the packaging it's not too big so it's perfect for traveling and um, yeah I really wanted to use something that has argan oil because um, it's really good for your hair if you live in Japan you can find this at Plaza I got mine at Plaza but this is really really good I really like this and it's affordable so um, yeah I highly recommend this if you have fine hair, I highly, highly recommend this. I know it's really annoying and, you know, it's really bad to have, like, bad hair day when it's, like, humid or when it's really dried and, you know, it's really annoying. So, um, this will save your life, I think. Next product might be a little bit TMI, but I have this deodorant and I have been loving this. I first tried this when I was in the States and it's Dove. Go Fresh Revive deodorant and it's their pomegranate and lemon verbena scent and it smells really good first of all and I mean it can be TMI but you need deodorant people you need a deodorant you don't want to sm you don't want to smelly armpits you just take care of your own armpits and just this one just smells really nice and fresh unfortunately it's not available in Japan so when I ran out of this I order it on Amazon I feel like in Japan we don't have huge selection of deodorant it's pretty limited so 
and I, I usually don't like the scents they have so um, I really like this and I repurchased it I repurchased it over and over and it's really good so I highly recommend and you know summer's coming up and you need to take care of your area so it's a good stuff next is food I have this peanut butter and it's sugar free so it's just like pure peanut paste and the reason why I went for sugarless um, peanut butter is because I can add sugar on my own and you know like Skippy peanut butter is really good but they have ton of sugar in it and I really wanted something really natural and something really simple um, so yeah this is like peanut only it doesn't have anything else in it this is a brand new one because I finished my last one that I had when I eat this I add two or three tablespoons of agave syrup and you can also use honey or maple syrup but I just like agave syrup so um, I just add it and I just mix it and it's um, sweeter um, on its own it's really it's sweet enough but I just wanted to make it more sweeter so I added the agave syrup and it tastes really good I like to dip some carrots and I like to dip some celeries and just fruits and vegetables in general it's just so good and I highly recommend um, choosing the peanut butter that doesn't have any sugar and you add it on your you add your own sugar or sweeteners because it's much better for your body and for your health so yeah it's really good next I have this puka tea and I love tea I drink coffee a lot but I also love tea it's their love tea and it's organic rose chamomile and lavender flower tea to warm your heart to warm your heart how lovely is that I need it to warm my heart so I chose this one and it smells really good it's really relaxing and um, I was looking for tea um, like uh, lavender flavored tea because I really love lavender tea um, that I was that I had before but it's kind of hard to find the tea that has lavender flavor so I finally found this one that has um, lavender flavor so I chose this one and it's really really good it's herbal tea so it's really good to take before bed and when you want to relax it's really really good and really calming and it's just I just love it so much and the packaging is really cute it's like a hot pink color and it's really cute so I highly recommend this next I have this sunglasses I have been obsessed with these sunglasses with the metallic effect I guess um, I have the one in blue and I have the one in orange and I just think it's so cool it's like I don't know I just think it's so like just so cool I love it looks like this <laughs> love it so cool and I have the one in orange looks like oh looks like this this one has the orange detailing and I really love it. Which one do you like? Blue or orange? Which one do you like? Which one looks good on me? Comment down below which looks good on me. Anyways, I really like it. Um, yeah, I think it looks really cool. It can look a little bit intense when I wear it, but I just think it's really like cool. I say cool a lot, but I just really like it. My eyes are really, really sensitive, and when I when the sun is so strong, um, my eyes get really red um, at the end of the day, and I really, really hate that because it hurts so much. So I try to wear sunglasses more often than before. Um, so yeah, I love it. And I also got this case from. H&M and it's like a floral print it's really cute um, so yeah loves it 
And last but not least, I have been loving this uh, singer. She, his name is Milky Chance, and his album is Sad Sad Necessary. Sad Necessary. Um, and my some of my favorite songs from his album is Stolen Dance, and I also love Becoming. And I also love um, Indigo. I'm really into Indies music. I think it's really chilled out and it's really calming and it's just like happy um, mood songs and I really really love it so much. I usually buy music on iTunes but when I really really like something I buy the actual CDs. I will put the link of some of my favorite songs from his album down below in the info bar so please go check them out. And yeah, that is everything for my April favorites. I really hope you enjoyed watching. Please give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and if you didn't enjoy it, give this video a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching my videos and please go check out my last videos and I'll be posting more videos so stay tuned and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe so yeah I will see you in my next video bye My lens is gonna say so I'm gonna clean that up. I'm gonna clean my lens. So messy. Okay, it's clean. It says uh, re replenish. Re oh my gosh, I can't be read English. Today I'm really thirsty and I don't know why. Mm. Mm. There's a hair in it. Um, I usually apply it in, at night. Uh, bef uh, can't talk today. My battery is almost dead. But I'm gonna keep holding. <coughs> oh my gosh. Okay.